What's up guys, it's your boy Pete and welcome back to Playing With Pete. Now, if you're new here, this channel consists of almost everything else point related. <laughs> the tickets your fancy. Hit the subscribe button. Sit back and just enjoy the time video. Alright guys, you're probably going to tell by the thumbnail. We are doing a pretty big plant haul. Now, majority, a lot of these, most of these, all of these but three, yeah, came from the South Ooh, Southeast Plant Show that I attended Saturday something something to one another. You see my post on Instagram. If you're not following me on Instagram, you guys go over and give me a follow. <clears throat> you might hear the fan trying to talk over a little bit. The cone is starting to cone, so I need to put a little bit more water in before it starts to holler. But what I will do, oh yeah, so I did a trade with Richie from Grofos here on YouTube, you guys go over and check him out. Like he, like he found some of the most awesome plants, and like he does like nursery tours, big box stores, things of that such. Finds a lot of goodies. Um, due to his video, I think I had just started following him um, here on YouTube. I went out and I found a my golden crocodile that I've been looking for for years. Just didn't want to pay that money. You know how it is. But I found it at the Walmart. But anyway, we did a trade. You guys, the postal service, like, that really pissed me off. Like, what I would do, I would insert some images and stuff of, like, the box that came. These people just... Anyway, um, out of those plants... Oh, sorry, guys. There was some, like, wrestling out in the grass or whatever it's called. Anyway, um, out of those plants... I probably should have got them. There's one. There's one. I'm missing one. I can't put my finger on it right now. Um, but anyway, I got those. You see how the box came? Horrid, right? Right. One of them I had to restart. I had the images. Future me have figured out. But um, one of them finally, like literally finally, starting to come back. Um, another one. It's like growing, we'll talk about them, but everybody survived, you know, um, everyone is growing. And then I've got, <laughs> literally been sitting in the same spot for like two days, have not moved. Maybe like moved left and right and up, you know, out of my way. <laughs> However, luckily the plants that we did acquire, you guys, it didn't, okay, well, I ain't gonna lie. I got more plants than what we got rid of. But technically, 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 they're small. Even if I combine them, I still got. I'm proud of my selection, you know. And we're just gonna go over it. So let's go ahead and get started, y'all. We're out here. We're trying to beat the clock. Um. So if you're busy, you have something to do, you guys, you might want to just, you know, pause the video. You know, if you just want to chill, grab your snack or something, if it's your lunch break, whenever you get to see it, watch some of it and come back and watch it later. I just do like I do with I get home and give me something to eat and then, you know, it's on at that point. But anyway, um oh my goodness, sorry about that guy. Y'all, I got stuff just scattered. There we go. I got to find pots. It's been a lot. It's been a lot. You know, and I'm trying to wrap my... All right, let's go ahead and get started. Now, the first one, I'll insert. I'll show you guys what happened. Wait, how do you do this? Here we go. Wait, there it is. See that? 
Yeah, it didn't look anything like this when it was shipped. Oh goodness, when it was shipped. But luckily, I am good with working with these here. Oxtails, aka Oxalises. Um, now this is, the, I think, the variegated one. I'm trying to see can I find like the black one. This is the one that has the uh, pink variegation in the middle, which is starting to come through. If I, there we go. If I can figure this here out. There we go, guys. It has like a little pink. Um, you can see them. Wait, where's my finger? Starting to come through. But anyway, that that plant was like I was doing that thing again. That plant was like destroyed in the box. But I'm trying to get my hands on the black one. Hard to find. Very, very hard to find. At least when I was looking <laughs> that one time, it was hard to find. Um, but yeah, we're gonna start it back over, and we're gonna get us a nice lush. Um, part of these again, but first plant we have the purple oxalis aka Oxtails all right, so the next one I guess I have to get up and start moving however We did get some cards and things but um, That first plant did I tell you guys already that, that was from Richie you guys from the trade we did and then Also from the trade we got my hand look at there Look at that, y'all. Look at, look at it. Look at my variegated orchid. Finally complete the collection that I, well, my collection. You know, I didn't want any of the other ones. Um, but yeah, I got a regular green one. And then I have my madame, which is that silver. If you don't have your madame, y'all get your madame. I'm telling you. I look at her just about every time I come out here. Can you see her? And no, you won't because she's on the other side of that. Yeah, but yeah, she's growing massive leaves. I'm learning now how to get them light so the leaves will be right. But she's growing. Um, pushed out this leaf here. Was pushing out, brother. Can I? There we go. She's like freaking gorgeous. They're having this little hanging situation. Right up on the spider farm like looks like she's enjoying it um she did make the transit they all of course came in um smaller situations this one was out still was a lot bigger of course but this one came in a smaller orchid pot and i had to transition them simply because of how they were uh, handled in that box and they're not even on the debt you guys they didn't say anything to either one of us and it sat inside of the there it is it sat inside of the post office for maybe two or three extra more days unnecessary days but it was just a lot y'all I mean, I mean a lot but yeah that really just it, it upset me you know but they still made it um and then the other one that we have right here is um, this is a Hoya. I don't even want to talk about that. Y'all see that pot? I'm going to talk about it. But yeah, we got this here Hoya. This is the Hoya Stepping Stone. Let's see, can we tighten this up for you guys? Uh, there we go. Gorgeous freaking plant. Has the inner variegation. It feels kind of like a birth. Is it Baterni? <laughs> Baternity test. Is it Batonier, but whatever that one is called, it feels kind of like texture-wise, but it's a lot thicker. Well, yeah, it's a lot thicker, and then the tops are like really like teddy bear soft. You can feel a little hairs. Mm -hmm. It's kind of cool, but there is some inner variegation. There it is on it, and of course, as you can see, I transfer her into my dirty sphagnum moss mixture um but yeah she's growing this is a proven winners yeah a proven winners brand leaf joy littles sea stone hoya yeah collection okay collection but yeah i wanted one i seen it on one of his videos and we did a trade which is like 
freaking awesome, y'all. I love this little plant. She's growing, finally, y'all, finally. She had a nice root system, but I'm pretty sure because of the, the extra 12 days sitting in the box, heat, um, and then the transition, um, it took her a while, but I'm not gonna do too much zooming in, y'all, but trust and believe me, she's starting to grow. There's like a little leafy there. Are we gonna get that? Yeah, so she's growing and she's sitting up here on the top shelf on the new shelf y'all enjoying life and i'm so i i'm not even gonna talk about that we'll talk about that shooting star which is shooting stars y'all it's shooting stars it ain't shot like that since i had it oh go in there fly can y'all see that y'all can't see that go on in there go in there that's one of the one of the plants y'all that i got from if i'm telling the fly to go in there then you know what it is yeah one of those plants and it's just sitting here i might need to pop i'm a i'm a pause i might need to pause this y'all because i want to watch this i don't that's just too much going on if the fly would just go in there already it's that's not whatever all right let's get this here oh, let's back over here all right guys so let's start with um i don't know guys not uh, the slightest of clues. Um, this is from House Plants for You by Karen Batol. Batul. Can we get that? Yeah, yeah. All right. So uh, I told you guys that we were hanging out. Like, man, when I say I went, like, it's like, like. It's, Y'all know how it is when you go in a place where it's like plant, plant, plant. And it's like stuff that you haven't seen, that you want, that you need, that you know you can't buy. But I'm glad I got a chance to see it. Stuff like that. Yeah. So from this here shop, I'm trying to make sure we have everything. One, two, three. I feel like I'm missing something. Nope, that's it. All right. No, here it is right here. All right, so let's start with the first one. Now this is the first one, y'all. One I've been wanting for a long time. Very, very long time. And I told you guys once I started to get these here inside of my collection that I will start to downsize. And guess what I am doing? Kind of sort of downsizing. At least out from out of here. But this is a variegated um, jade syndapsis. Let's see, can I tighten this here up? There we go. Um, one of these days I'm gonna run across what are you trying to focus on? Whatever you're trying to focus on, you're trying to focus on everything else but the leaf. But you get it though, right? Yeah, gorgeous freaking leaf. This is the first leaf. Second leaf, third leaf has a variegation on it. Um, I've been watching it as it's been unfurling. I thought about actually giving this thing a pole, you guys. Getting it on one of my planks. I said, no, nah, we ain't gonna do that. We ain't gonna do that. We're gonna save that potential spot for something else that will lead yeah that will need a spot and then we have to rearrange there's a lot but anyway um she's growing and don't know what type of mix this is but it's very airy very chunky we're definitely going to get her out of this here into a dirty spag the moss mixture fairly soon like i said they've been sitting in here for like two days in whatever mixture they've been in um these ethereums well i guess you know and i have some ethereums then right so these ethereums definitely need to be I'm moving y'all I'm trying to move and 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 <laughs> record and not record and just move and push some of the stuff you know onto the tube and not onto it's a lot it's a lot and then trying to live life at the same time you know that part but variegated J always wanted one finally got one like I said I'm gonna get out of whatever mixture this is I really wish I knew what you was focusing on, guy. Y'all know I moved that bag. It was focusing on, there it is. It was focusing on the bag the last time. That was the freaky spot. There we go. A little blurry on the, okay, I like that better. So when I do this, you can see it's shite. There we go. All right, but variegated jades and dapses, first plant. Y'all, I think I acquired 20 plants. Can you see one that's hanging behind me? Yep, right there. Right there. Let's go ahead and grab it. All right. Let's go ahead and grab it. Now on the way home, 
I I couldn't help myself. I wanted one. This is an Apigia, a Piscia, however you want to call it, you guys. I don't know which kind or which variety this is, but it was on sale. It was like seven dollars for this. I said, yeah, I'm gonna get it. It was thirsty, so I get a little drink of drink. And now, you know, she cooling. Now I did have some props down here that are in this little water thing. So what I'm end up doing is probably just cutting all the trailing ones and um, have them in the shop, giveaways, or not giveaways rather, but extra um, plants or cuttings. They kind of grow like your, I'm gonna say strawberry shape. Like your, what are those things? Strawberry begonias? Yeah, strawberry begonias. Like those, yeah, little clusters. You break them off here and they grow entire into a whole, like that. And then they grow into a whole entire new plant, you know? Um, I'll just stick you down here with the rest. We're gonna pop those up too, so. Yeah, I might just go ahead, well, this is not what this video is about. But, um, yeah, I got her, I saved her, I love her, a peach I don't know which one it is, looks like she's fixing the flower, I'll show you guys real quick so we can move on, yeah, right up in there, can you see that, yeah, that's like a cluster, I'll turn it this way, wait, there it is, like a cluster of flowers come in, but she sits here for now, until we can figure some things out, and, yeah, Another one. All right. Um. Let's see. Can we? Are we? Yeah. We staying together. That one was from Lowe's, y'all. That that didn't come from plant for you. House plants for you. Yeah. I got it. Yeah. All right. So this one here. Let's start here. Not again. Not sure what. Oh, at least it has. I didn't know it has holes in the bottom. Um. This is the SKG Silver. Oh, how are we doing this? There we go. For, oh my goodness yeah now I can tell that this here I don't know this I don't even know if this is a top cut but anyway y'all there's like multiple multiple growth points I don't know if you guys gonna get that or not all right yeah multiple growth points you guys um and she's in and I mean multiple like one two three Four, maybe five growth points on here um, she's like barely in here but I have been keeping said I wait on the roots is that all the roots no there are plenty of roots in here y'all they're on the side here they're white healthy looking so I have not look like it's on it's growing literally by one root so what I'm going to do I've been letting her sit like this uh, but normally, I say normally, but she would grow like that, which is how I'm going to have her once I fix her. Um, let's get her back. All right, there we go. So yeah, SKG Silver. I wonder. Freaking look at all this, y'all know I'm into the silver. I couldn't help myself. Elongated leaves, kind of like this here next one. Um, but yeah, SKG Silver. We're gonna get her. Uh, definitely get out this here mix and put her in something way better than what she's in and what I'm used to growing y'all uh, next one we have the Celebi Celebi, oh, Celebi Silver now I don't know what I'm going to do I'm not going to do it but I'm going to <laughs> I said I'm not going to do it but I'm going to um, yeah I can tell this definitely needs to come out of here I see good roots though she has good root system yeah she has a nice root system and this is another one that has like tons of growth points i don't know this one is probably i don't know or maybe that's how they grow but here's her here she um uh oh i'm not even gonna come on leaf come on leaf there's a new leaf there that has damaged a lot due to me um it's okay though but this one is healthy it's growing been watching Mr. Leaf, Mr. Leaf expand. Um, hopefully these leaves, that's what I was fixing to say, hopefully these leaves get darker. Maybe it's just um, 
the watering, which I can definitely see like the watering situation on here. Let me just do this like I've been doing, which is why the other one came out, the SG, uh, yeah, SKG. Whoa, which is why that one came out. Um, but yeah, hopefully guys, um, this one here gets a lot darker, but again, if not, we're going to uh, continue to grow out and play with it. Again, I do love the elongation of the leaves and then that silver, it just couldn't, you couldn't, you know? So why not? I got it, yeah. And yeah, yeah, you know? All right, the next one we have is a gorgeous one. This is a red crystal cross forgetty y'all white stripes freaking gorgeous y'all um another one that's in a weird mixture i say weird because i'm not accustomed to it and usually when people grow their plants they're growing them based on what they can grow in and off their um, growing environment so it's just like you living in arizona why would you put your philodendron in the airy, in the airy uh, mixture. It wouldn't make sense, right? So you're going to go with something thick that can hold a little water. But anyway, yeah, this one is holding a little water. Um, but yeah, red crystal, forgetty eye, white stripes. Love this little plant. It caught my eye. I snatched it up. Um, we're going to grow her out. Hopefully this is a fast grower. Someone let me know down in the comment section below. Um, I love the silver. The silver is what got me. Fuse, sinus. Awesome, y'all. Awesome. But we got her. I love her. It's very tiny. Look at it. Yeah. Hopefully about time. I'm going to say the next time because you're going to see these again. We're going to get these out of the substrate. We're going to have a day. Y'all, I don't know if I'm going to do it off camera or not. But we're going to figure it out. But yeah. Red crystal forgetty out white stripes. We're going to pour out. Um, and all of these here came from the house plants for you yeah but she gave me a bag and I did I'm gonna have to start that's gonna be the thing if I if I don't get cards y'all I'm gonna start getting bags at least that way um I know that the bag I have the the name on the, the situation right but all right so that's all the plants for you okay now the next one did these come from the same situation? Mm. I don't know if these came from the same situation, y'all. But in the same bag. We had to do some separating of some some plants and things, y'all. And and stuff got oh okay, so this is from the alright, so these are the cards. I don't know where that is from. Yeah. Alright, so Let's go with Honey Botanicals is what's on the name, you guys. I had to get this here, girl. I wanted her so bad. I'm pretty sure you know what this is. This is the Hoya, <laughs> the Hoya Gang Bang, all right? That's what we're gonna call it, the Hoya Gang Bang. It's the Hoya Goon Goon Gang Goon Gang Goon Gang Gang Gang. That one, yeah. Um, Kevin from Hakuna Maplana, when he first got these years ago, I think I wanted one. Whoa, you better not. You see all this going on. Luckily, my third eye caught that thing. Um, but yeah, this is, did I already say it? Yeah. The, the Gunan Gendang, the Gunan Gadden, whatever. Um, I wanted it. Kevin had it. He started to stretch the hell out of it. I loved it. Um, it's, if you can just not just sun stress like the hell out of it y'all um but give it like the right sunlight that he had these things sun stress so freaking pretty huh i wanted it it just it gives you that sleek look like i always tell you guys about like when you compare like the exotica to the silver lady you really can't because the silver lady has that clean like i don't know how to explain it like clean just sharp straight to the point you know look like this one here like you compare this to the Callista Fowler the Callista Fowler it's gorgeous but it looks like it grows the pattern just all over you get it but anyway I got her yeah um, and again this is from the Haunted Botanicals uh, what I'm gonna do is that a peduncle oh this thing has a peduncle donkle 
But yeah, guys. Yeah, this is another one. Yeah, my goal was just to go for a, a few Hoyas and some Begonias and some Strappy Leaves. I was so disappointed. I did not find any Strappy um, Pendant nothing. I mean, I've seen a few that I already had, but none of them they were small anyway. But no big size with lingeries, no big Patriciae's, head of, head of Raceos, is that right? And what's the other one? I don't know, guys, but look what I got. Look what I got. Look what I. <laughs> All right. Hoya. Y'all know what this is. Hoya Husculiana. That's what we're going to call it. I was gonna go mad dog and buy them all. I was gonna go mad dog and buy them all. But she, this one has like some nasty area roots. I'm not gonna cut her, however. Gorgeous. What I'm thinking about doing is getting me some Kiki paste. It's, yeah, Kiki paste and just going crazy. I do know it works real good on um, Ethereum and definitely Philodendron. I've never tried it on a Hoya. Hmm. Hmm. Something to think about, but yeah, his Giliana in a variegated. She's, she's. I was gonna go to Connors, y'all, and get me one, but I'm glad I went up there. I knew I was gonna find one. I'm glad I waited because they had. You have to shop. The thing is, you have to shop around and pray to the. Oh, it is a Patonko, and pray to the plant gods that um, about time. You come back for it, it's still there. I don't know if it's gonna pick it up. I don't feel like tightening it up, y'all. Y'all know what a patonkel is. So yeah, um, and then this nice little cup thing, fairly rooted. We're gonna get out and get her a nice little situation and go from there. Um, should I show you, I'm trying to think, should I show you my whatnots? We'll add, we'll add the whatnots into like another, cause right now, yeah. Here we go. Hoya Hiskiliana. I can tighten it up for you guys. There we go. I guess as I tighten it up, we can try to. There's the donkle. There it is. Oh, there, oh, there it is. But anyway, yeah. She's gorge. Now I need to. Yeah. And the crazy part about this is they may sit in this bag. Well, sit in these bags in their situations. For another day hopefully not too um, but it all depends on how much work we get done I don't know what the dog is talking about but it's important uh, but yeah it just depends on how much we get done today okay next let's go with um, this bag here this from plant daddy's I think this is from plant daddy's Oh, sheesh. Oh, sheesh. Oh, okay, thank the heavens. I found you. I was gonna have a whole count. I didn't know exactly. Uh-oh. Yeah, okay, I have a lot of cars. All right, guys, so this here next one is a Begonia. Um, Harmonious Begonia. Now, I'm pretty sure this came from Plant Daddies, which Yep, ah, plant that is what I got. Yeah, plant that is of Atlanta. That's what we got this here from. Ah, oh, gorgeous, right? There we go. It should have been like the first video. Um, you definitely should have seen that video of the plant show by now. Um, it was in the first clip, but mama is freaking gorgeous, right? Rex. Of course, you know I'm into it. I'm into it, y'all. It took up my fancy, so I had to get it. Um, I was looking, what disappointed me, I was looking for, did I tell you guys what it was? Silver dollar, begonia. Gorgeous, right? I mean, pure silver. At least, at least, at least. Can we get this? Let's see, can we get this? Wait, where's the leaf? There it is. Oh, it's picking that sh up. It's picking that up. Can y'all get that? You see what I'm spit? Look at the veining. Come on, look at that veining. It got little sp It is so freakishly gorgeous. Right? 
Yeah, I grabbed it. I freaking grabbed it. And I can't wait. I cannot wait. Oh, this is what I was telling you guys. Uh-oh, sorry. This is what I was telling you guys. I need some more pots. This is gorgeous. Come on. Grow with us. Plant that. Yeah. All right, let's stratum at the bottom. And then, also from Plant Daddy, you guys, we got this one here. Gorgeous, right? Let's tighten that up. Ooh. Ooh. Come on, y'all. Ooh, we, if that ain't doing something to you, even if you can't grow these. Jesus, you cannot deny this foliage. This is the fireworks. Begonia. And of course, Rex. I had to. Oh my goodness. Oh, let me take this flower off. It's for the flower. And I definitely don't need that. Not right now. I mean, I don't do flowers at all, but you know, sometimes I let it do its thing. But anyway, yeah, freaking gorgeous plant, y'all. Come on. Let's, let's untighten it. Oh yeah. Imagine this thing huge, like up here with the rest of these. Oh yeah. Come on. Oh my goodness. Oh, I just put it up under the blue light. It looks good. Gorgeous. But fireworks, Rex Begonia. I'm trying to cover, there we go. Rex Begonia. Freaking beautiful plant. It's just, the camera don't do these things no justice, but you get it though. You get it. Yeah, but we're gonna get her some water first. Um, but yeah, we're gonna get these into a bigger pot situation. Self-watering, more than likely. Yeah. Um, and go from there, but these are the only two. Yeah, these are the only two that I got from it's like, I'm not even gonna bother that. From the plant daddy of Atlanta. Put them up and back where they were. Let's go here. Well, let's see. Okay. Alright, guys. So, we got this little buddy here. I'm not sure what's the name of this here airplane. Um, however, I will have the name on the screen because I did take a picture because I knew I was gonna forget it. But it's think the start with a B or F. I seen a lot, so one of the other. But it's nice airplane. I should have got the one with the blue, the blue silverish tint, the little hairs on it. Um, but this one is funky as well. I do love it. You will see it again. More than likely, um, I'm gonna hang this. I'm gonna do a. Um, a situation with my orchids um, on one of, we'll, we'll talk, well you'll hear more about it later on but I got one of these also this came from not even, nope it came from some, nope yeah, but we got it though uh huh um, what's next, let's get you back alright um, let's go here now this one I had to get it, I told you I'm having an issue with silverness. Uh, my first astrophyllum. Um, this is a bishop's cap astrophyllum. There we go. Um, I'm not even going to try to myro shagragragra. The gorgeous though, right? Gorgeous. Feels like a little reptile, like that little lizard. Have you ever touched a lizard? Lizard. Feels like a little lizard. Um, there's some protruding here at the top. It feels flowery like. Making sure. Yeah. I'm trying to make sure it wasn't pearl like. It's not moving. So it look a little flowery like. Gorgeous, y'all. It's like. I'm like. Yeah. My first one. I don't know. I guess I'm going to treat it like the rest of them. And just bottom water it. I do see roots on the bottom here. So she could be time for a bigger pot who knows but before I do tackle plants like this I definitely go and do some research compared to the ones where I say I'm gonna do it but I don't do it yeah um, but yeah we got her we're gonna figure out she's gonna be situated with her homies 
you know. Yeah, silver ish, bluish. I love it. Okay. All right, there we go. So yeah, Astrophyllum Bishop's cup. Got it. Next. Oh, all right. There's my badge. Now this one here is one I've been wanting for years. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I'm pretty sure you've seen it also. Here we go, y'all. You know, I'm pretty sure just by looking at it, you can tell exactly what it is. Wait, what are you focusing on? Not this deep. There we go. This is the... I got the Bishop Cup stuck in my head. Globulosa. Freaking wonderful. Plant. She's definitely been growing. Um, she shot out roots, area roots, since she's been in here. And again, they've been in the same spot for two days, y'all. Doing their thing. Nice, thick, hairy leaves. I'm pretty. I don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up. It probably could. You know, <laughs> I would have pick it up. I ain't just think at the time for it. Um, but yeah, I had to get her. I really did want it. I should have got the other one that was semi trailing already. <clears throat> I'm noticing the leaf the leaf ratio you know oh yeah it's definitely growing it has it did not have any of these areas on them at all but Hoya Globulosa I grabbed it <sighs> this is the same vendor that had those freaking money trees that I wanted that I should have got that you seen on that video but it's one of them stupid things that I like to do. Don't grab it and then just pray and wish that out of the 18 million people that came, I was the only one that was looking for a variegated money tree. Yeah, right. That thing was gone. It went bye to the bye. What his name is? Instinct? <laughs> bye, bye, bye. It went. It went, y'all. Let me just get you out of it. I can technically hang you somewhere and you can be out the way until we figure oh that was almost been a mistake until we figure something out you can hang here nope because i'm putting that putting this back no nope, if i put that back up there, then it's gonna it's gonna focus on that um where are we oh this soil y'all i'm all over the place today where did the extra fly here we go yeah we had some some turnovers, it's okay. Alright guys, next one. Don't know. I don't know. Um, now this one here, you know, I did, I tried to support a lot of the shop. Um, especially the shops of, <clears throat> of color, you know. So, um, oh this one is wild and green. So I just seen your card. Oh, this is the one. Yeah, she spent some money on her card. It's like shimmery. Anyway. Um, yeah, she had another Hoya, which I had to get because, again, I told you what I'm on, what type of time I'm on, y'all. So we grabbed us a, I should have grabbed another one, but we grabbed us a silver dollar Hoya, gorgeous freaking this. And it has this crazy big blue <laughs> butterfly clamp um, on it. But yeah, definitely gonna get her down. Yo, this is the newest leaf right here. It came in on it there. But she's growing, y'all. We're gonna get out that she's growing in the medium. But hold your silver dollar. We're gonna need to. Let me just clamp this back before something happens. All right, guys, we're almost sort of kind of through. Sheesh. All right, so this is the next one. Whoa, all right, so we need to give her some water. This one here is the Alocasia Watsoniana. Watts the Watsoniana. Um, this one here was one of the ones we separated. Again, they've been in the same spot. So I'm not worried about this one because of the core, but I am fixing to get her in some soil immediately. 
I do see some babies popping out. Um, yeah, this is the one again Kevin had. Freaking wonderful, gorgeous, nice silvery bay nation on the leaves pattern. It's gorgeous. And then the purple plum backside. There's a new leaf coming through. Um, what I'm going to do is use this same here little pot that it came in and I'm going to I don't know yeah I'm I'm a I'm a I'm a I'm a um fill this up with soil we'll be right back but I'm gonna fill this up with soil give her some water um let her tinker in here a little bit and then she's definitely gonna go over in the palm situation and let her palm her life out um, which is another reason why I think I told you guys I wanted to cut back some of the foliage. Those plants are huge. Just because I cut the leaves, the root system is... Uh, okay, so yeah. Uh, yeah, let me go get some soil and we'll be right back. Alright guys, got her in the pot. A little bit more soil. Um, yeah, so now we're just going to wait on her to perk up. I technically could cut... Yeah, I'm going to get rid of this one. I technically could cut the rest of them off. Um, so she can focus more on this one leaf and that root system, but gorgeous plant Yeah, so now I'm gonna put her over. Let's put her down here and when we get through I Could put her in the palm area. All right next plant. Let's go here. These are the last two. Yeah, here we go guys Got a nice here picture plant picture picture plant plant um, this is the Lunchbox Cross Hawaiian Ice. Or I don't know what S A R R is, but we have her in this here situation. Um, this is a prop. I think that is the tattoo. Um, but anyway, I got some distilled water, y'all. I, I couldn't wait till it rained. It just it wasn't it wasn't happening. But they come in this nice red plumish color here. Gorgeous. There we go. Um, this is why I was telling I, I didn't want to be, I was telling the fly to shoot, but I wasn't thinking. The fly was trying to do what it was supposed to do, and I'm shooing it away. Anyway, yeah, it's in this situation until we come up with another situation, but it is distilled water. Um, the roots are looking a lot better than what they were before. A gorgeous plant. Um, tons of growth points, y'all. I can't wait to this thing. I seen like some bigger ones they had. Wonderful, but of course I didn't want to get nothing big that I could potentially kill because I never grew up before, right? And then the last but not least, we have, all right. Oh, it just had to drop all on my phone. Water. Um, we have the ping and water. All right, let's do that. There we go. I got me a ping, y'all. And of course, about the time I found the pink, they were all gone. This was the last one. The last one. They had some real tall, tall. Some real, this is water. They had some real small ones, but I didn't want to go. I should have did it though. They were like three, four dollars. I should have got them. Um, but from what I've seen and heard, these things do um, spread. And they grow pretty quickly once they're established. Are you gonna, I don't know what it's focusing on. There it is. Um, but she's gorgeous. She's, uh oh, definitely been shooting off roots. Um, it's gonna be growing in stratum. Where this come from? Okay, this came from rainbow carnivorous plants. Yep, rainbow carnivorous plants. Gorgeous plant. Yeah. Um, another one. These two made me go and get that um, distilled water. I had to y'all so I didn't lose them um, which is why I was telling you guys one of those videos my fly trap is kind of struggling but it should be okay now we got water and definitely seeing new leaves <coughs> but um, yeah oh now and then we have one more no we don't yeah I didn't even go over this one y'all last but not least um, we got me one of these here this came from a girl um, curvy plant lady you guys Definitely she shows up, um, usually at a lot of the um, big events and things that I do attend. 
Um, she's definitely over on Instagram. Go over and check her out. Um, she has a shop as well, you guys. Well, I got this oh, from her. Um, in this here, nice clear pot. Semi-chunky, looks like chunky air mix. We're gonna get her out of this, you know me. Um, new leaf coming in. I've been keeping an eye on it. The sheath had dried around it, y'all. Don't know what that was about, but I'm keeping my eye on it. Hopefully everything goes according. Now she has been hit a few times. This leaf has been hit a few times. This is okay. But all in all, um, gorgeous. Another one that I want to get up on the wall, plank wise. But guys, that is it here for today's video. As you've seen, like I really enjoy myself. And again, I cannot wait until next year because next year I'm pretty sure it's going to be um, a lot bigger than what it is now. So, um, let's do a quick run through. We have wild and green. There we go. Wild and green tropics. Rooted Somerville, looks like. Yeah. Um, Somerville, Georgia is located. Wild and grow. Um, don't see where you're located. International Aeroid. Ah, gotcha. This is Rusty Exotics. All right, Rusty Exotics. Um, then we have Green Room Exotics. We're a plant shop. Um, also, Instagram Green Room ATL. Um, Hunted Botanicus. Um, then it also has the QR, you guys, to scan. Um, and then we have Plant Daddy's ATL, Marietta, and Canton, Georgia. There's also the QR as well there. Then we have the Drunken Known Plant Crystal Company. I'm the Drunken Known Project on Insta live sales as well sweet solutions you guys i got some cookies which are freaking wonderful y'all like for real for real for real for real for real um and then komoribi studios plants creativity there it is growth uh that's also a scan there but guys, that is it. That is freaking it. Hopefully I didn't forget a plant. If I did, I'll insert it somewhere. Um, but that is it here for today's video, you guys. Please do me a favor with the like button. Let me know down in the comment section below what plants. Okay, what plants did you see? What plants did you see that I have that you want? What plants did you see that I might have that may give me difficulties? Definitely let me know. But I think for the most part, I'm okay. I don't know about these here, but we shall figure it out. Um, if you like to support the channel, you guys have hit the shop. Go and check that out. Um, there's also this thanks button down below. Just hit it. Two dollars, four dollars, whatever you can give. That definitely works. Um, also, watching the video and liking the video definitely works as well, you guys. If you, you can't give it away, just hit the like button. Watch the video, you know, and call it a day. But that's it, guys. I'm going to try to push out one more video today. I have to do an edit on another. There's a lot going on. It's not what this is about. But, whoa. But, um, I'm going to enjoy my plants. Definitely um, get them out the bag. I took like the Ethereum and things out. Just so this, you know, circulation of air and stuff. But, that is it guys. Like, comment, share. And make sure you all subscribe. Make sure the notification bell is on. This bell will keep you notified. And let you know what Pete got going on over here. And as you can see by all this stuff, there's a lot going on over here. And what I'm going to do right off camera, you guys, is I'm finally, finally going to go in and spray these things down. I did check the fest. The only thing that it can probably catch is a spider mite at this point. That's the only thing that seems to live is spider mites. Everything is through Beyond a Free. But guys, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Um, thanks again for supporting the channel, especially those who went to the Etsy shop and just just damn near wipe everything out um but like comment share again like i was saying subscribe i'll see you guys on the next one bye